Hello and welcome to Raven's Arcana. I am Raven. Thanks for being along for the ride. I hope everyone is doing well and having an amazing day. Uh, today I wanted to discuss the full tarot cards, so number zero in the major arcana, and specifically what messages, what meanings, interpretations are supposed to come through when this comes up in one of our readings. I chose this card because I really think it embodies everything about what the fool is supposed to mean to us. Look at the vibrant colors all over this card, you know, and the fool is going to represent new beginnings, opportunity, potential, and really embarking and taking that leap forward towards the journey and being on the path to soul perfection. Now we see our figure on a path and that path is full of lushness. There's green grass, there are green trees around that is gonna represent growth, the growth of the inner self, of the spirit, of the soul. It's gonna represent fertility. Are we laying a fertile foundation so the seeds that we gather along the way can grow and become fruitful for us? It's gonna be abundance. Are we gathering an abundance of information that we can use in a positive manner so we can grow. We also see that she has indigo on her boots as she's walking on this path. Indigo is gonna represent wisdom. Are we taking that information, understanding it, and transmuting that into wisdom that we can share with others? It is our responsibility as we gather all this along the way to share our experiences with others. It's gonna represent justice. Are we doing things in a just manner, in fairness? Are we being fair and kind to ourselves and to our surroundings and other people? Now, as we move up her outfit, we see that there's a scarf around her neck. And that scarf being around her neck is gonna represent communication, right? Communication with the self, how you talk to yourself and how you communicate with others. Now it is red and white. Red is going to be love. Are we loving ourselves? Are we showing compassion for others? It's going to be authority. Do we have authority over our own path, our journey, our life? And it's going to be power. We are coming at this with power. We are confident. We are courageous. We are going to persevere, right? We also see the white on there. The white's going to represent safety. This is going to be a safe journey for us as long as we pay attention to the signs along the way it's purity that perfection of the soul that we're trying to attain right it's also going to be the veil the veil is lifting for us we're going to have access to the akashic records to previously occulted and esoteric knowledge and once again with a scarf around our neck we're going to share that information that we've learned along the way with others that is our responsibility as we continue to move up her outfit we see that her hat is purple purple is going to be intuition are we listening to our gut are we listening to our spirit guides right i think that's very important the intuition part of this right because we're going to have people along this way they're going to try to derail us off our path but as long as you have that intuition, listen to your gut, you're going to be fine. It's spirituality, right? We're trying to attain spiritual perfection, trying to perfect our soul. And it's oneness. Are we one with the universe? We talk about the micro and the macro, right? Are we connected? Now, if we look in the background, we see orange. Orange is going to be creativity. Are we getting back to our passionate, creative self, right? Also going to be energy. Do we have the energy to continue on this path regardless of how difficult it becomes? And it's also going to be playfulness and joy. Are we approaching all these experiences along the way in a joyful, childlike manner? Now, when we talk about soul perfection and we talk about this journey, we also see the birds up in the air, taking flight, 
right? We see the squirrels are even up in the trees. That's going to signify ascension. It's going to sig signify trying to raise your vibration. We also see that she's traveling light. She only has a purse, a satchel, a bag, whatever you want to call it. She's left everything that has been weighing her down, all the possessions, everything else behind her. And uh, she's just moving forward through all of this, heading towards that soul perfection, taking the opportunity, realizing her potential, and taking flight. All right, awesome. Thank you so much, uh, once again, for being along for the ride, for your time. If you like the video, please give it a like. If uh, you're returning or if you're a new viewer and you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and hit the uh, notification bell to get uh, new content on your feed. And uh, take care of yourself and have an amazing day.